At Vimeo, we're constantly releasing new features. From Vimeo AI and video creation, to hosting and analytics and our newest tech integrations. We built these tools to help boost team collaboration, drive productivity, measure viewer engagement, and streamline workflows. We then packaged them into a single ecosystem of tools to make your life easier. There's a ton of new updates, so we made this video to help catch you up. Let's start with Vimeo AI. Once you've created or uploaded a video, use AI-generated titles, descriptions, tags, and chapters to put the finishing touches on your work and save valuable time. Seeking something shorter, Vimeo can do that too. With the click of a button, get an auto-generated highlight reel that recaps key takeaways from your video. And get this, with our chat with video feature, viewers can ask the video questions by selecting from pre-populated Q&A or asking anything that they have in mind they'll get taken to the exact spot in the video that has the answer. Impressive. Next up, events and video creation. Meet Venues, our virtual events platform that really enables you to capture the richness of in-person interactions. Viewers can engage with presenters and other audience members using GIFs, emojis, hand raises, embeddable third-party widgets, and breakout rooms. They can even blur their backgrounds. In order to make events more engaging, we've also made improvements to our broader events platform. You can now pause and rewind streams, and moderators now have the ability to reply directly to audience Q&A and embed the player in new ways. In addition, we've added a new library of drag and drop video templates to the editor in order to speed up your video creation and editing workflows. But wait, there's more. Video management, analytics, and hosting. Looking for easy tools to manage, share, and track all of your videos? Our video library centralizes all of your video content, making information much faster to access and distribute. With our improved transcript search, go beyond just scanning video titles and their descriptions. Search the transcripts of every video in your entire library for keywords and phrases to see how many times and in what context each term is used. Then jump straight to those moments within each video. You can even use app mentions to tag collaborators at those very points. Or share specific chapters or timestamped segments in parts of videos you want them to see. But what if you want even greater control? Grant contributor access if you want certain team members to be able to manage access to videos in addition to just viewing them. As a whole, our redesigned video settings page makes it easier than ever to manage key actions like adding captions, making videos interactive, and editing. It's got everything you need all in one place. We've always offered robust analytics, but with our redesigned dashboard, you can now break down viewership by top regions, sources, devices, and videos. Our updated team analytics also shows who on your team has watched which videos and for how long. And last but not least, integrations and API. It can be hard to keep up with constant project updates. You can now connect Slack to specific folders in your video library and get notified whenever there's changes inside that folder. How convenient. If a video is uploaded or edited, new comments are added, or changes are made to privacy settings, you'll get a notification with a link out to the video. We've also made a slew of improvements across our CRM integrations to help you better manage your leads. And finally, we've expanded our HubSpot integration to more easily segment leads and automate workflows. Users can now access their videos and viewer level analytics from within HubSpot through the MediaBridge API, as well as drag and drop videos into HubSpot campaigns. Easy. That's everything for this quarter. Read more about all of our new capabilities and try them out today. Yeah. Woo! 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 Woo!